Hi, I'm Scott Shorter. In part two of our multi-row overview series, we'll take a look at how simple it is to create your own template. Get ready to break the gridlock with multi-row. If you missed part one of this series, be sure to check it out on gvtv.gcpowertools.com. Now let's get started creating a template from scratch in multi-row. From the project menu, choose add new item, then multi-row 6.0 template. Input the name of the new template, my template, and click the add button. My template has now been created and add it to the current project. Multi-Row's 23 built-in cell types have been integrated into the Visual Studio Toolbox. Drag cell types from the toolbox to the design template. Position and size the cell types using snap lines to assure that each added or resized cell is laid out consistently. Add cell types from the toolbox to the Multi-Row template and create a simple input or display interface. Compile the template. Now add a multi-row control to the form. Set the My Template that was just created to the multi-row control by clicking the Smart tag and selecting My Template from the list of available templates. Run the application and you see the multi-row control displaying our template layout. The control is not bound to a data source, so using this mode requires entered data to be managed and persisted by the application. Multi-row templates can also be generated dynamically by choosing Bind to a Data Source, then choosing a data table. Associate the data table with the predefined style of GC Multi-row. When dragging the data source to the form, the multi-row control is added to the form. At this point, the multi-row template wizard guides us through selecting the data fields to display, basic layout options, and applying of styles and themes. The template is created and added to the solution. When the application is run, it displays the data from the data table and allows for CRUD operations with this data. So far, so good. But to improve on the default layout, choose Edit Template from either the Context menu or the Smart Tag, and build the template desired. Flash forward ahead and we achieve the exact layout wanted. The Template Designer provides the ability to preview what the template will look like at runtime. And we can also interact with the templated control to verify the UI behavior we want. Through the Print Preview tab in the Designer, we can see what the multi-row control will look like when printed. The multi-row design time includes a toolbar to simplify applying design and formatting options to layout templates. Style information can be set to the template sections, such as setting the back color of the column header section. Now, each control added to the column header section will default to the back color that was set for that section. Multi-Row is now packaged with your purchase of the professional edition of Spread.net. A great value. Just go to gcpowertools.com slash spreadnet for your free trial. You'll get Spread Windows Forms, Spread ASP.net, and Multi-Row, all in one powerful package. I'm Scott Shorter. Thanks for choosing Grape City Power Tools. Smarter components for smarter developers.